We made it to Santa Clara, California, location of the Levi Stadium, home of the San Francisco 49ers. But it isn't football that brings the fans to the stadium this week. It's the Coors Light NHL Stadium Series. The Los Angeles Kings will meet the San Jose Sharks outdoors in this beautiful interior of the Levi's Stadium. The pre-game and intermission entertainment is looking like it will be amazing with such stars as John Fogarty, Belisa Etrich, Chris Allen, and Symphony Silicon Valley. Plus fans can interact through their smartphones during intermissions to produce what promises to be a dazzling light show. Workers have spent several days preparing the field for NHL ice hockey and transformed part of the parking lot into an NHL fan experience for all the visitors with tickets to the game. And right now we are in the Levi Stadium, home of the San Francisco 49ers. And today the media have the opportunity to skate on the ice ring that is ready for the game of the LA Kings versus the San Jose Sharks this weekend. How are you experience right now on the ice? Yeah, well, you know, the ice is the ice is fantastic. In fact, I'm just amazed at how well they're able to do this outdoors, and especially here in California. It's not the uh, the ridiculously cold weather they have back east, but gives us a chance to have these outdoor games out here. Great stadium, and it's, uh, it's fantastic. I love it. I was at Dodger Stadium last year. Ice was great there. So, hey, it's all about California, you know, when it comes to hockey. We are back at the Levi's Stadium with the NHL. This morning, there was a press conference about new statistics platform to serve the press and the millions of hockey fans across North America. It's giving just a wealth of tools to fans to really take situational analysis into their own hands and say, well, I want to know how my player isn't just doing against the league or just this season. I want to see how my player or team is doing against a specific team or a specific player. This will be a great benefit to fantasy league players who rely on stats for their season. What we'll then be able to do is take all of that data, put that into visualizations, put that into advanced filtering. So that way, really with all the tools that we have, you can compare Crosby to Howe, to Gretzky, to Richard. We'll be the only league that owns all of its data like that and then can bring it all in-house and then really you can get the breadth and the history of our league in one place. Well, as they said, we've been working on this program for the last eight months to develop uh, the statistical format and uh, put it on the website. Do you have any big concerns before you guys made your decision? No, we were very comfortable that SAP would provide the expertise and resources necessary to make this project work. After that, we will watch the two teams in Saturday's game practice. And it's practice day right now. It's happening here at the Levi's Stadium. Behind me, the LA Kings are getting ready, preparing themselves to see how strong they can come out this weekend. And the Kings are about to conclude their practice for today. Let's see what they have to say after this practice. It's something we have to we have to go out and you know the bottom line is we need two points and you know we can't get caught up in you know everything and we just have to play a simple game and go for the two points. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're always a tough team to play against. They're big with skill and they finish checks, so they're a hard team to play against. And 
you know, we just need to be ready to come back with the same effort. You know, but the climate's a little bit different than Dodger Stadium. The ice, it's, yeah. I feel like it's a little bit different. So, uh, you know, back, it's no. not going to be, you know, I guess different than, than last year or any other game this year. You know, it's going out and try to win the game. Well, I think you just you get to balance it out today, you know, and kind of go on the side of enjoying it all and, and looking around and, you know, just enjoying it. And that's the, that's the bottom line. So tomorrow you come back and, you know, you'll take in the crowd and everything, but if puck drops, it'll be exciting to get the, the energy up, the intensity, and, you know, play the game. It'll be great. It'll be exciting. We've seen a football game here, you know, earlier. Um, so to have a hockey game here and, kind of experience that crowd will be pretty exciting. This is Claudia Gestro for the LA Post Examiner.